gathered here today to reflect on and to celebrate my father's dedicated support to all of you and the work that you do. But first, I would like, to, like us to take a moment to remember all those affected by the tragic events at the Manchester Arena a year ago. We are fortunate to have over 250 representatives for the emergency services here today. It is right that we take a moment to recognize the amazing work they do every day and how each member of our blue light services rise to meet the challenge of tragic events such as the attack a year ago. We are also joined by Youth United Cadets. Their organization also provided triage support to the medical crews on the attack. So, on behalf of my family and everyone here, I would like to say thank you to the emergency services and all those who supported the injured and affected. My brother William would be here today were he not attending the service in Manchester to honour the victims, their families, the emergency services and the survivors this afternoon. Our thoughts are with those who lost loved ones and those still dealing with the experiences of that night. In fact, many of the issues William and I now work on to protect, protect a particular species under threat, with which William and I draw inspiration from every day. To save an input, sorry, <laughs> that bee really got me. <laughs> so, Pa, while I know that you've asked that today not be about you, you must forgive me if I don't listen to you, much like when I was younger. <laughs> And instead, I ask everyone here to say a huge thank you to you for your incredible work over nearly 50 years. Amazing. It's great. It was great. <laughs> Surreal. They were really friendly yeah. as a couple. And it's really lovely. Yeah. yeah. We said congratulations, and then they said thank you. And they looked really happy. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> they were so charming.